This is a class on railway technology at a vocational college in the city of Kunming. All of the 32 students are from neighboring Laos. The China Laos Railway opened in December. It links Kunming with the Lao capital Vientiane. Now, Laos needs more specialists in this field. This two-year training program is part of the larger infrastructure project. Upon completing the training, the students will become teachers at a similar vocational school in Laos. The language barrier is the biggest challenge. Interpreters play an active role in the teaching process. Despite difficulties, we all work very hard. We also have a Chinese language course given by a professional teacher, and the school has matched each of us with a Chinese peer to help us. And teachers also try to come up with innovative approaches. There was no railway in Laos before, so there were no words describing railways in their language. This is a big problem. So I try to use as many pictures, videos, and even animations to help them understand what I teach. Apart from theoretical knowledge, there are also simulated training courses, where the students can learn essential skills in an efficient way. The college believes it will gain valuable experience in international exchanges through this program. When these trainees start to teach in Laos, we send our teachers over there to assist them for a five-year term. This program is like a seed. With it, the friendship between the two sides will also bloom. In the seven months since the cross-border railway opened. It has transported more than five million tons of goods. I hope China and Laos can further expand educational cooperation, especially on the cultivation of railway specialists, to guarantee that China-Laos railway operates in a more sustainable way and benefits more people. The railway has made travel more convenient. And also created more business and job opportunities. Yang Jinghao, CGTN, Kunming, Yunnan Province.